All right, Brendan. Um, so well, you, you know, you've got one over there. You've got the uh, a pumpkin. What do you have? Nutty Pumpkin was my AOL screen name yes, back in the day. So this was. works out very well. Mm -hmm. Good morning, friends. Good morning. Good morning. Nice to see you both. Lots to get to today. So let's keep it rolling. Okay. This train is off the rails. It's off. <laughs> <laughs> well, as we've been telling you every day right here on the Roadshow this week, I am, yes, a massive WWE fan. And for all of my fellow WWE fanatics out there, we have something very cool taking place right now on our website. It's a little something called Get Ready. Hang on. Brendan's Roadshow Ticket Mania. <laughs> Love that. Well, in case you didn't know, next year's WWE WrestleMania, the 40th edition of the pop culture phenomenon, will be a two-day extravaganza taking place in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, and your TV buddy BK has your tickets. Check it out. Head, head to the contest page at Roadshow.com. It looks just like this. To enter, the contest is open now through August 30th. And we will announce our two, count them, two winners on the Roadshow on Friday, September 1st. Now check it out. One winner will win a pair of tickets to the Saturday night, April 6th event. And the other winner will win a pair of tickets to the Sunday, April 7th event. It's a two-night extravaganza, Will. You'll have to get yourself there and book your own accommodations. I'm not driving anyone to Philadelphia, nor are you staying with me. <laughs> but here is a very fun way to get into the event. Very, very cool, and we are pumped to be giving away these tickets. Now, as we continue with our WWE-themed fun this week, we thought we would stroll down memory lane. As regular Roadshow viewers know, in my 45 years as co-host of this fine television production, I have made a fool out of myself and embarrassed myself with countless guests right here in our studio, and I am never more proud to do this than with some of our favorite guests, the WWE superstars. Here now are a few past clips of me with Carmella, Elias, and Cody Rhodes. Enjoy. I went to URI, actually, for, and I graduated from UMass Dartmouth, so this is kind of my area. So, um, But of course, I always have to rep Staten Island because I am the princess. Absolutely. Well, you know, I, I'm, I like to think of myself as the Prince of Providence. Oh. So that works out for both of us right here. <laughs> Can you imagine the two of us as a mixed tag team? We would dominate. Would we? Oh, oh, you have no idea what you're dealing with. Oh, don't, what are you laughing at over there? I know a few holds. I know a few holds. I can drop an arm bar. I might do it to you, too. Oh, wow. Watch your back. WWE superstar Elias. Good yes, morning. Sir. Hey, good morning, man. Thanks thank for you. having me. Yeah, thank you for being here. Now, of this course. I'm a longtime WWE insane nut. I've been going to the events. I since could feel your energy. I know. Yeah, and look okay. at my physique. Uh, yeah, uh, and you know? that as well, of course. Yeah. <laughs> Obviously. Yeah. But, uh, <laughs> what are you laughing at over there? <laughs> Someone really got a kick out of that. I yeah. sure did. Well, I pay him to laugh at me. Do you play guitar? I like to. I'm a, first of all, I'm a master of the air guitar. Okay. Secondly, I know about one G chord with the acoustic. Yeah, record. I know. So I normally play an E minor chord, and I noticed your fingers. I couldn't hear it or anything backstage, but weren't where they they should have been. You know, and <laughs> it uh, it was almost disrespectful for you to say, know. you know, Elias is coming, and here's a G chord. It just it upset me a little. You know, bit. I think yeah. the word pathetic is the one you're looking for. That's good. Yeah, <laughs> that's a good one. We can't thank you enough for joining us right here today, and tonight we can all walk with Elias, can't we? Yes, WWE, it stands for Walk with Elias. Never forget <laughs> that, okay? Well, thank you for allowing me to talk with Elias. No, yeah, of course, talking with Elias, a good time. It's thank you for having me. It's going to be a great me. show tonight. Now, this yeah. neck tattoo of yours has become so iconic, so synonymous <laughs> with you, Cody, and I know yeah. looking at it when I see it, it's, it's so it's tremendous. Did it's it big. hurt? <laughs> uh, it did. It did hurt a great deal, and um, I, I was trying to wrestle her through it. Oh, you want to take a break? You want to take a break? Never took a break. W wish I had taken a break because it's giant. Right. Well, it's I've been giant. inspired by this, and I wanted to see what I might look like with a neck tattoo. Yeah. So, what do you think about this right there? Do you think it works for me? It's, <laughs> well, hang on, there oh, it is. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you know, it's it's perfect because it like when you throw on like you got the collar on, it just pops up enough that people can be like. That's a bad dude. I am a bad dude. That's right. All right. Don't forget to enter our sweepstakes on Roadshow.com right now. Over to you, Audrey.